Flacco will take to the air again. That's going to be caught at the 10 yard line. Eight yards on the completion, but now they face third down. Obviously, this has not been a banner game throwing the football. So, what you got to do, you got to kind of down focus, don't you think? Find the tight end, take some easier completions. The interception last drive there, he hits the reliable target. Flacco looks to throw. That's caught at the two. Four yards on the play, and that leads to the first and goal. Well, they've had a great, impressive drive going here, and that pickup ensures the drive continues. And not only do you continue the drive, which is demoralizing for the guys on the defense side of the ball right now, but you make your own defense happy. They're able to get a little more rest over on the sidelines while this one continues downfield. Well, we're not playing three yards in the cloud of dust football anymore. I kind of get why those old school coaches sometimes didn't want to throw the football. Because if it's popped up in the air, it almost just... And he will take it in for a Ravens touchdown. Terrence West taking it in from a yard out. And the Ravens have retaken the lead. And while that touchdown does not give them an insurmountable lead, it's still a lead, and that always feels good to a team. They'd love to take that into the lockers, but a little time left on that clock, so some work to do. I like that. I like how you're guarding against a letdown yeah, there. Are you looking forward? Coaching them up from right up here in the booth. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. And last year, that would have been a net gain of five on the return. This year, he stopped where he would have been if he had taken a knee. And that's at the 25. The Seattle now ready to march out of the field. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively, they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. Check 50. Check 50. Check 50. Check 50. They go play action here on first down. Now a clash of bodies here, and it's intercepted. Picked off by the longtime charger, Eric Weddle. And now Baltimore gets set to take the field. And this is a spot late in the clock near midfield, though. Maybe take a couple chances, see if you get in field goal range. You do that if you have trust. And this should be a position now where the great ones, they relish this opportunity to try and put points on the board. They get the pick. Now what can Flacco do on first down? And he's got his favorite target yet again. It's complete. It's an eight-yard pickup, and that'll make it a second down. Seeing that play and understanding just how tough it is to cover tight ends, especially the ones running around the NFL nowadays, makes me glad I didn't make it in that league. I would have had a really difficult time. But now you get to sit up here with me. Yeah, and that's fun, isn't it? <laughs> and what a really nice game right there on first down for them. Brings up a nice second down for them. Teams appear ready for the fight ahead, and we resume action here in quarter number three. That's fielded in the end zone. And the decision to bring it out is going to cost him about seven yards, all told, as he's taken down back shy of the 20. Out come the Ravens now. They'll go on offense first here in this third quarter. They have the lead. Now they'll be looking to extend that lead. And this is where I enjoy talking about one of my favorite subjects tendency breakers or counters as I also like to call them. You've done things in a certain way in the first half and they've had ability to see what you've done. They're going to make their adjustments. So guess what? You adjust yourself and try and stay ahead of the pace because you are looking for some separation in this ball game. The adjustment to the adjustment. Without a doubt. <laughs> show them one thing, hit them with something else. They come out five wide, three of them to the right side. Flacco to throw again on second down. And this time he's got the hookup. It's complete. That catch good for five. It's third down. Got to give credit where it's due. Really nice defense on that play. The pitch and catch was successful, but not any run after it. So third and medium here, third and five. Third down, Flacco from the gun. And he's going to be intercepted a third time. A great one. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. They were in the dime. They had six defensive backs there. So go ahead and.